Hey, hi, what's going on, guys? Welcome to digitalage.com, and today we're gonna get started with jQuery Mobile. Guys, jQuery Mobile is one of the best and the easiest way to create mobile applications in no time. So, guys, instead of writing code for every single platform, we can only write our code for one time and we can deploy it on any platform. And recently, I have received a request where I've been asked. Uh, if I can show how to create a survey application for mobile so I thought this would be the right and the best time to get started with it so what I'm gonna do is uh, right now I'm on the jQuery mobile op official website and you can click on this particular download link and you will see this particular page guys as of today we have the latest version to 1.1.1 so what you can do is whether you can download these files you can host it on your server or you can copy these three links and they're gonna you know get you the source code for jquery mobile so that what i'm gonna do i'm gonna copy these three files okay and right now we're gonna build a very simple and a basic template using html and that template can be deployed on any mobile platform so i'm gonna copy it and I'm gonna go to my WAMP www folder because we would be making use of PHP and MySQL as a server and language that's the reason I'm gonna make use of WAMP server on my local Windows machine so here I'm gonna create a new folder I'm gonna name it to jQuery mobile okay and here I'm gonna create a new file called index.html for now because we are not dealing with any PHP uh, at least for this particular video so I'm gonna you know open it with my text editor and guys uh, you know quite often I have been asked which particular text editor I use so I just want to let you know it's in type and you can make a Google search you're gonna get you know a download link to in type so here I'm gonna start my HTML template okay and out here in the hit section I'm gonna paste all three links that I've copied from their actual website Guys, after copying these three links, we would be uh, ready to go ahead and create mobile applications. So, uh, the very first thing what I'm going to do is, here I'm going to create a div with an ID called header. And guys, out here I'm going to say a data row to header. Guys, now, whenever we are creating applications using jQuery mobile, this particular thing called data row plays a very important role because this is the only thing which gonna let these uh, jQuery and I would say style sheet know what we are trying to create okay so here I'm gonna say you know heading one to page header okay uh, then I'm gonna say dev ID content and then I'm gonna say data role content and let's say here this is page content now guys uh, this particular ID have nothing to do with the data row so if you want you can name it to you know something called top or whatever you want but you know in order to you know uh, for simplicity I just want to you know keep both of them the same so here I'm gonna say this is page content content like this and finally I'm gonna say uh, div ID footer here I'm gonna say data row would be footer okay uh, here I'm gonna say an h1 to uh, this is footer okay and guys one more thing we need to do is we need to wrap everything uh, with a dev you know data role called page so here I'm gonna say dev data role gonna be page so it's gonna let you know jQuery mobile know that this particular you know block of code is a page okay and inside that page this particular thing is a header because we have give it a data role called header here and this one gonna be the content this one gonna be the footer so what we're gonna do is uh, I'm gonna open it with you know um, a Firefox browser so I'm gonna browse the folder called jQuery mobile and guys here you will notice we have a page header we have a page footer and a page content and if I will resize it you will notice it's resizing it itself we don't have to drag to right or left and guys if you have a live server you can actually upload this file and you can open it with your mobile and you're gonna notice everything is same out there so guys this is a very simple way to create an 
uh, template using uh, jQuery mobile and guys uh, let me tell you one more thing the best way to learn jQuery mobile is to make maximum use of it because there is no rocket science behind it you will not have to learn any new language all you need to do is you need to understand uh, how to use uh, HTML structures in order to build a page so you can also go ahead and you can access the documentation provided by them uh, you can probably go to docs and there is a very long documentation that you can read if you want but uh, in the next video we're gonna start building our application and at that point of time we're gonna learn more about jQuery mobile so I'm gonna see you guys next time goodbye